He's just um shut. So all I did was stand in front of him because when you start putting your hands out, I, I give hey, hey, hey. And you. Sure. I give the barrel first because that's more effective. And he was like, oh my god. Right. <laughs> I'm sticking up for you, pal. I am. I know, I'm sorry. <laughs> so I'm going to change his uh, association with him. Now, if you look at the husky, can you hear him? Yeah. So he's getting really uncomfy because, don't you start, because this one comes in and gives it the big I am. Now, I weren't in, uh, I weren't in quick enough to see if the husky triggered it on sight of him, which I suspect might be happening. What's a husky call? He's called Bill. Bill? Bill? Yeah. Hey, Bill. Kevin, no. Hey, Bill. Yeah, we didn't go for the Nordic names. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're all called that, aren't they? So you can see by stick him in a different room because yeah. he's not helping. You can see by his lip licking, even if you don't hear the growling, you can see his lip licking, his intense stare, he's really not, not happy with him, oh, Mr. Uh, Cocky Draws here. Yeah. So what I'm going to do... <laughs> Bill, because he feels trapped because he's in his den that should be a safe place and then this idiot comes in like a tornado and he's like, whoa, I'm here in your face. I'm going to change his association with you, pal. I thought he was growling then. Good job I looked before I give him a crutch. Just breathe yeah, <laughs> So for the video, I just did a stress yarn. I'm just um, letting this one know he's all right to be in here. We don't want him to be frightened as such, but we don't want him to be so cocky. I know he does make funny noises, doesn't he, Bill? Come in then. And again, we finish on a positive. You can't go. You can't go. It's the face-to-face -face that, that triggers. And huskies are very scary dogs anyway. Frenchies are very scary dogs. So... I would say for him, he can never come in this room unless he's on a lead and supervised. Because otherwise he's going to do exactly what he yeah, did and come great, yeah. flying in. Good. Come on. Good lad. Again. Good boy. Bill, shut up. Go on. Good boy. So we're teaching a new game. Come on. Good boy. Go, 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 good lad. Oh, you're going to be sleepy after this. <laughs> yes, you are. Come back. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, good boy. And then turn good around on. and bring him straight back out. Go, let him stay. Good, good boy. Good. Nice. Good. Obi, come on. Obi, come on. Good. Nice. Right. Beautiful. Don't let him stay. Take him further. Turn and come back. There you go. Good boy. Woohoo. Good boy, <laughs> Obi. Wow! Oh, okay. Thank you. Less noisy then. Oh, it's chaos, but it's we just don't want the, the hassle to do. You know, yeah. Frenchy not getting on the bus. Really. <laughs> That's why I was videoing that, I could see that was going to kick yeah. off, and that's frustration. But again, see what happens, you let him win! <laughs> Just hold that camera Will on do. him, so that you can see him. So he's like a gladiator, he wants everything, everything has to be his. And nothing is his. Oh. Oh, is it gone off? It's gone off. I don't know if that's... Oh, it's just the screen. And you can see, even when I took it off him, 
He thinks he has a right to everything. So we're going to do some work with this guy. Because he thinks everything is his, isn't it? Him? It's mine today, Pa. What I'm waiting for is for him to move back, good boy. So he moved back to give me some space, which is respectful. But he knows he can't have it stuff. But from a different angle, you can fly on it if you want. You still can't have it, pal. New big chief in your ass today, isn't it, mate? Okay. Good. So when he leaves it, he can have it back, but it's on my terms, not on his. Oh, you go for the rope. Oh, get it. 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 Basically, he thinks everything in this house, or in any house, is his. But to stop that, we have to say nothing, it's all mine. So again, what I'm going to do is wait for him to move back from me. Or I can move him back by moving forward into him. But look at his fixation, even on a toy. I can't give it you, pal, because then he'll have an attitude with you. At the minute, it's mine. So because I'm impatient, I moved him back. He gave me a foot one paw movement of going back, but I want at least a foot in distance of space, if not more. So you want the rope, do you? Yep. Oh, so you're going towards me and you want everything that I've got, it's mine. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh, the boy, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Get it. Ah, get it back. Good. Yep. His pupils are massive, which is his excitement and his adrenaline kicking in. But notice I'm not entertaining the tug of war game he's trying to play. Mm. What I am doing, I'm pressurising on his mouth and as I'm doing that, I'm pulling the rope out of his mouth And flaming. He intensified, good. He intensified when, um, what's he called, came over? Kevin. Kevin. That's a, a bit of a, a, a naughty bark. Yeah. And that's what this guy coming in. So we're going to say he is going to trigger the second. He's not even come in yet, seriously. He's already just on the thought of him. There he is. <laughs> right, so cover him over. And your fingers, because he's got heavy fingers. So when he's in that anxious state, we don't give any nurturing because you're nurturing the anxious mindset. Are you right? Right, okay. Uh, don't ambush me, don't. No, really, I don't want to look like a monkey. Thank you. Oh, I just said no. Thank you. Yeah, so, every time, <laughs> every time Bill comes in, he has to be covered. Because even when Ted came in, he's triggering just as something coming through the door. Yeah, so he's not really, when he's not in his cage, I just look like a big nose then. When he's not in his mm -hmm. cage, he's not the issue. It's him. Son of a mad dog, that, you know, Bill. That is, um, it is like frustration. Isn't it? He 
Here, here, here. Here. What's this? What's this? What's this? Come on, come on. Good boy. Sit. Sit. Good boy. So we interrupt the chasing of the tail and the cooking of it. See, you can't interrupt it because. Because <laughs> I'm a cheat on. <laughs> yeah. Interrupt him. Let's see what he does. Just put it there. Mummy. So yeah, just distract him somehow, whichever way you can, without him ch um, chewing on you. Good. So you see what I did? I give him an instruction of sit. I don't know if he knew it or not. Yeah, yeah, he's good to sit. So I give him an instruction again every time he starts doing it because this is a bad habit and we don't want him if he's confined to his cage a lot when. Um, he's over. We don't want him to start chewing because some dogs will actually mutilate themselves. And, oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It can be a serious. It's not just a play thing, this. No, and it is a. I mean, they do it as a puppy. They do do it, but is it his age? Yeah, we we, we don't encourage it. Hey, hey. Ready? Come here, come here. Bill, I know you got a mouthful of husky fluff now. Come here, come here, come here. Good boy. Sit. Okay. Yeah. So get him to sit. 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 Come on, sit. He's right. like, well, I have my butts on. Yeah, he's kind of stuck <laughs> out. Move forward. He's doing well now to keep quiet whilst he's making all the noise and yes, moving so. around. And <laughs> he'd be absolutely no, you knackered. Really Are yours? Yeah. yeah, he's doing well now. So with him, he has to be covered up all the time. Now that was a good test because he went near the cage to get his ball and he didn't make a sound which was good. So he has to be in his cage and covered up all the time so that he can't see him. Um, and then you could try just bringing him in off the lead because he's not bothered at all 